Oh my god, Austin, where'd you get that really cool hoodie? Oh, this hoodie? My Klushka Vlogs hoodie? Guys, if you want this hoodie or even more merch, then I got a link in the description. You should go check it out. Welcome back to Road to the Show 217. Let's get right into it. I got this. Ah, look how packed Angel Stadium is here. I hope and I imagine it'll be like this on opening day. Usually is for Angels fans, but as the season goes on, things start to fall in the bad luck category for us. So it usually starts to thin out, but hopefully that will not be the case this year. I hope things go oh so well. That said Griffin Canning was 3-0 with a 1.84 ERA. Okay, don't know when he got that good, and that ball is foul. I gotta change my bat. I had this flower bat for Mother's Day, is that what it was? Why did I have this bat? I honestly don't remember. Here's this pitch coming up. Ball, outside, don't want that. And uh, I really would like to sweep the Mets. We already won the first game. And we need to keep on winning here. And that, ooh, man, late decision on that foul ball. As you can tell by the size of my PCI getting bigger, we are getting higher with our overall. It's about time, and that's not going to do anything for us except being out, damn it. I cannot wait to go back to games, bro. WBC is right around the corner. That's going to be my first taste of baseball this year in my WBC Mike Trout jersey. Should be coming in by the next episode. Almost killed the umpire over there. Don't worry, he's alive. He's going to be able to have dinner with his family tonight. And I'm really hoping that I will not allow this baseball to have dinner with his family tonight. Because I'm going to kill it. I am going to destroy the baseball and send it 450 freaking feet. Okay, do you understand me? Here we go. And now that should sneak up the middle. It will. Don't worry. That baseball is only a little beat up. It'll be fine. It won't even have to go to the hospital because it's just a lousy single. But in a scoreless game, that lousy single could turn into a run, and that run could turn into a lead, and you don't think you're going to pick me off, buddy. It ain't going to happen. How you doing, Polar Bear Pete? What would I be called, bro? You got Polar Bear Pete right there. Austin Kleshka. Austin Killer Kleshka? Killer Klesh? Maybe I pull a Seth Rollins and I... Oh, that got through. Didn't think it would. I'm going to go three. Ain't no way you're throwing me out, buddy. Yeah, I went in standing up. Wow, I had mucho huevos right there. And Anthony Rendon on a 1-1 count. I am rooting for you, buddy. I really hope you get this RBI. I really hope you don't get a double play right now. In a 1-1 count, I'm hoping for contact. And you got the contact here, but Rendon is so slow. We're not going to get a run out of this. Unbelievable. Rendon, you got to do better, bro. You got to go hit the bike or the treadmill or something. Joey Wendell, and if you still don't know this, Cowboy Jeff it loves Joey Wendell. Don't know why. Never understood it, but he's obsessed. And currently the Mets have a lead of 2-1. to one. Hopefully we can kill that and all of their lead, all of their hopes and dreams in this game. And hopefully this time I will kill the baseball. All right? Get a bunch of barrel on it and send it into the night sky. But no, we got the same exact thing as last time. I just beat it up a little bit more. And once again with one out. This is scary similar. If you guys could give me a nickname since I'm going to be talking about Pete Alonzo again. You know, uh, Polar Bear Pete, Big Meat Pete. What, what's the nickname you would give me? Huh? You know, I mean, Spidey's the obvious one. I just got picked off because I'm an idiot who's trying to jump way too early. Dude. I, oh my god, we're not going to get a lead back with that, especially when they score seven more runs. Why? This game just hates me. And now that'll be a fly out. I didn't get all that. I should have swung early on that to make it a double down the line or a home run. There's Dom Smith, by the way. Uh, Dom Smith, really cool guy. Met him at the BBG event. And they have Adam Frazier? Didn't know that. Well... Hopefully, we can beat them in this next game right now. Yeah, we're getting the flower bat out of here. That one's called Iceman. Has like this Yeti Goblin guy looking through the bat. I'm going to go full Yeti Goblin mode right now. Oh, they do have Adam Frazier. He's batting fifth, batting 301. Only guy on the team besides Starling Marte batting over 300. Damn, nothing compared to the real life Adam Frazier. He is quite dog water now, isn't he? 
That's what I remember from the previous season. Patrick Sandoval, man, I hope you have a good year. You had a pretty solid one in 2022. Here's Jordan Yamamoto. That's a ball way outside. Yes, we all know Austin Kleschka is the hit streak record holder. We all know I broke this game because my hit streak got too high. And now that ball's very high, and it's going to be an out. Any solid center fielder will have that in their tracks very easily. Damn it. Okay, well, I have not been rocking the ball, but they jump out to a good lead right there. Four to zero. That's not what I wanted to see, man. Come on, we have to be better than this. Steven Duggar is going to lay down a ball that I'm gonna not going to be able to do anything with. That sucks. That sucks a lot. Damn it. All right, well, hopefully we can jump back into this. We got one run. We did not let them get more than four, especially after how bad that last inning looked like it was going to be. That's pretty good, not going to lie. We still got plenty of game to get three runs, if you ask me. I think we'll be all right, hopefully. And, oh, catches the corner on that one. Honestly, did not think that was going to be a strike. Come on, 0-2, and almost hit me. All right, we're good, we're fine, we're going to be okay. And we are going to crush this baseball right about now. Get up the middle, sneak up the middle, sneak up the middle. Apparently that's all I'm good for in this episode is just base hits up the middle. That's all I'm good for, man. If the rest of the bats behind me could help out, then we might be on to something. Mike Trout has a 3-0 count. That is a good sign for something great to happen in this inning. And he gets that walk. All right, cool. It moves me up to second. And now Jared Walsh sitting on an 0-2 count. That does not make me feel good about this inning. Come on, Jared. Prove me wrong here against Jordan Yamamoto. And he struck out. You did not prove me wrong. All right. Well, hopefully Anthony Rendon will come through. He also has two strikes, but I feel like Rendon has been more reliable to make contact with two strikes. Let's see if he proves me right. And he did. And I kind of let the third baseman right into that. Damn it. Once again, that's on me, man. That is on me. All right. What's up now? It is still 4-1, to one, but this is the best opportunity we've had to get back in this game. You got to do it, Austin. You got to come through. And ball way out there. If we walk in a run, honestly, no. I don't want the walk. What am I saying? Because I don't believe the batters behind me would do the job. Here we go. And now that's going to go foul. Oh, my God. That was the juiciest pitch I've seen all episode. And it went foul. I am heartbroken over that. Can I get that pitch again, please? Please. And get through at least. Yes. Okay, that'll be one. Are they going to send 66 speed? Yes, they are. And he will be saved. That's Douglas Stevens. We're down by one. We are still in this game, ladies and gentlemen. Okay, it'll be Mike Trout in a 1-1 count. He could do this. I'm going to take a nice little lead. They're not going to try to pick me off, right? They're going to let me be. They will. And Michael hit it very well. And it's right at the left fielder. You got to be kidding me, dude. What's up now? It is Why? They keep jumping out to these huge leads, dude. They make us think we have a chance, and then they just take away all of our hope. And wow, that was one of the latest swings I've had in a long time. Okay, come on. Do better. Be better. And he almost hit me in the knee. I would have not been able to be better if I would have got hit in the knee. But I avoided that, and I wasn't even phased. Not at all. Ready for this? Oh, my God. Why with the pickoffs, man? You guys are up by five. Okay. And you got two outs right here. Focus on the batter in the box. Me. I know I'm scary. I know I'm ferocious. But you have to go through me. Unless you walk me on purpose or you get me to ground out. Oh, my God. Well, we're either going to get one more at bat or it's game over right now. We got one more. With two out. Josh haters on the Mets. Oh, goodness, dude. I was not expecting this at all, and I could be the last out. And foul ball on a Josh Hader fastball. All right, let's see what we can do. Iceman, Goblin Yeti, that's me. And we are here to keep this game alive. Ball outside, all right. Man, that arm angle, that whole movement that he goes through when he pitches, tough to read, not going to lie. And now, did I just go deep off Josh Hader? Please tell me it gets out at the wall. Oh, my God. 
Oh, I really wanted to take Josh Hader deep. But no, they take those two games, and they take away all of our hope for now. Wait, Gary Sanchez was right there. He used to be on our team, and now I guess he's a member of the Mets. If you made it to the end of this video, I want you to comment. We will get our hope back. Like the video, subscribe, tell your mom, your dad, your grandma, grandma, pets, friends, brothers, sister, and uncle. Everybody know to subscribe that already. I got this, you got this, we all got this, and I'll see you next time.